Hello, I'm Mike, and welcome to GameQuest News. Before we get started, I'd like to thank this week's sponsor, uh, Bizarre Technical Issues. More seriously, I was late in posting this week, first, because I spent a long weekend out of town visiting my parents' place for a number of reasons, including helping with a roof repair project I didn't realize I was signing up for. Then, when I got home, our recording computer through which we record all of our gameplay content and these channel news vlogs was stuck in a weird update loop. Basically, it would try to update, fail to install the updates, and then immediately reboot to try again. Trying to abort the process caused it to run a system check to make sure not following proper shutdown startup protocol broke anything, before noticing, oh hey, I have an update I can install. I better do that. Life is pain. Uh, forcing it to boot into safe mode would let me look at the desktop, but somehow disabled my recording setup. I finally managed to wrangle control of it, at least for the moment, but I'm still looking into a long-term fix. I've had my share of weird tech problems, but an unstoppable 12-hour reboot loop is a new one on me. In addition to this, I am pleased to say that troubleshooting for alternate recording options is going well. After a bit of trial and error, I've managed to get my 360 working, albeit with a weird audio delay on the recording side of things. Extremely fixable, it's just going to take a bit of fine-tuning to figure out the exact timing to compensate for. In happier news, as of Tuesday morning this week, episode 9 of our Ocarina of Time playthrough has been reinstated. Like I thought, there didn't appear to be anything wrong with the video itself. It probably just tripped whatever false positive that got two of our earlier videos pulled, and it just took YouTube a long time to get around to reviewing it and fixing the problem. Understandable. Because we're a small channel, it's a huge site to try and manage even in less uh, turbulent times. Frustrating, because all it would take is three to four of these issues cropping up before YouTube corporate tries to fix it. And it's been weeks of delay on a daily upload schedule. But hey, everything's golden for the moment, and hopefully we won't be seeing any more of these issues in the future. And since we're on the topic of YouTube and amusing tech, <laughs> channel metrics are hilarious for a small channel like ours. I took a glance this morning and apparently our like 20 unique viewers and dozen or so hours of watch time represents a 14,000% increase in viewer scope and retention over a month ago when our channel basically didn't exist. I don't want to overhype things, but we keep growing at that rate. We should have 5.5 million subscribers by Thanksgiving. Uh, and that's about it. Until next week, I'm Mike and this has been GameQuest News. See ya!